Good morning, everybody. Thank you for coming, and greetings from the Casino Pier Arcade in Seaside Heights, New Jersey. I am excited this morning, very, very excited, to extend a very special Seaside Heights greeting to fans from all over the world of internationally acclaimed and Grammy-winning British folk rock band Mumford and Sons. <laughs> Mumford and Sons, winner of the Album of the Year Grammy in 2013, announced a little while ago that Seaside Heights will host the band's first Gentlemen of the Road stopover of 2015 on June 5th and June 6th in support of the band's new album, Wilder Mind, that the band's releasing in North America on May 4th. Each stopover is a two-day event that combines the intimacy of a community celebration with the excitement of a world-class music festival. Mumford and Sons will headline the Saturday show alongside an eclectic and energetic roster of artists curated by the band themselves. A series of smaller events involving local businesses, venues, and most importantly, local people will happen in and around the town. In the band's press release this morning, Mumford & Son said, the gentlemen of the road stopovers are all about live music. We get to put them on in towns not normally frequented by touring bands and buses or splinter bands. We deliberately look for towns that have something unique. There's a lot of the business people that really were struggling for the last two and a half years after Superstorm Sandy. And we're looking forward now. The people are highly motivated, and this is what we need. This is the spark button. Mumford & Sons will use its extraordinary international celebrity to shine a light on Seaside Heights. This is an opportunity for our residents, business owners, and friends to come together as a community, to be happy and hopeful, and to show our guests on June 5th and 6th what Boardwalk Americana is all about. The Seaside Heights is really devastated. It's coming back better than ever. But we want people really to experience what's been going on over the last two years as far as not only the rebuilding, the new activities, but the spirit that we have. A lot of the business people are really devastated. But now they're back in town again, we're doing very well. But the money that's spent is very important to us. It's an event that Seaside Heights has been longing for. These are the things that we want to change and the things that in the direction we want to go. We represent all the amusement parks throughout the state of New Jersey. So to have something this exciting, very close to one of our partner parks, which is the Casino Beach Pier, board of directors they are also, is very exciting. I would like to thank the band for giving Seaside Heights the opportunity to host this event. A few months ago, band member Ben Lovett dropped in to walk through Seaside Heights and he had lunch with Mike Gration and me and representatives of Madison House Presents which is the team that produces the stopovers and one of the things that struck Mike and me when we met Ben was his interest in Seaside Heights and what Seaside Heights has been through the last two and a half years. Superstorm Sandy, the boardwalk fire and as we all know this, the great challenge of rebuilding our community. When we heard about what Seaside had been through, we came down and, and took a visit and immediately fell in love with the place and with the people. And from day one, it was a natural no-brainer for us. If the town was, was willing to go through the work with us, we were, we were in from, from the go. The main stage will be set up on the beach near Grand Ave facing south. Tent camping is, is being permitted and encouraged on the north side of Casino Pier. We are working with our friends in our neighboring communities, Seaside Park, Lavalette, Toms River, and Ocean County to provide off-site parking that'll supplement a shuttle bus system. The band is called Mumford & Sons from London. We put out two records. Young guys, love music. The Mumford guys had the honor of playing a couple shows with Bruce Springsteen around the world. And 
I think they have a real fond spot in their heart for what Jersey and the Shore meant to him. And so come to Seaside Heights and enjoy the activities in Ocean County.